I'm going to show you how to make a sentence building activity in Clicker 6. First, I'm going to show you some examples of sentence building activities using uh, worker sentences, which is a pre-made activity that comes with Clicker 6. I'm just going to click on the next button here, and I have sentences 1, 2, and 3 to choose from. If I click on sentences 1, I have a whole lot of sentences that I can click through, each following the same format. I have the model sentence up here, which I can click on. A baker bakes bread and makes cakes. And then all the jumbled up words in the sentence, which I need to unjumble. If I go back and click on sentences two, there's now no longer the model sentence, but I can click on the I and see that model sentence. A baker bakes bread and makes cakes. And hear it as well. But I can't click on anything before I close the pop-up. Bakes bread. Okay, if I go back to sentences three, I don't have that pop-up either, but I can just hear it. A baker bakes bread and makes cake. So I just have an auditory hint. Um, now I'm going to show you how you can make any one of those types of sentences, but for sentences that your learners need to learn and practice. I'm just going to clear this document by saying document, new document, don't want to save any changes, and there I have a fresh document. Click a set, new clicker set. It's a grid, it only fills half the page, and it's a sentence building activity. Now all of your wizards will look very similar. You'll have a blank space into which you can type or paste some text, which is going to be your sentence, and then over here is your preview. Okay, I'm going to say my name is Tammy, just typing that in. This is obviously preparation that you would do before you come to class. Um, and then I'm going to go to Microsoft Word by minimizing clicker. Um, or let me just bring up Microsoft Word over here. Okay, and copying this text. Copy, going back to clicker and saying paste from clipboard. There are those sentences that I had in another program. So you can actually paste in some sentences from any program, even the internet. Now I'm going to choose what type of model I want. Either don't provide a model, or the model on the grid, like sentences one, or the pop-up model, like sentences two, or the spoken model, like sentences three. I like the pop-up model. And then my layout can be regular or with a picture. With a picture is just going to save you a bit of space on the side where you can bring in a picture later when you've got a few more skills in Clicker and you know how to bring in pictures. Let's just make it regular for now. Keep things simple and say create. Now I have a sentence building activity. My other sentences activity is still open at the bottom but I can go back to the one I just made and I can say my name is Tammy, full stop. My name is Tammy. I can double check. Yep, that looks good. Close that down and go slowly through all your sentences and they'll all have that pop-up model. Um, you could even have made the sentence in Afrikaans and please go to the training video on how to make Afrikaans sentences just for some tips and tricks if you're working with other languages. Thank you. Bye. Don't forget to like Edit Microsystems on Facebook.